Welcome back everyone. I know that many of you want a Norska back, so here you go. We're currently attacking Kislev. I did bring back Wolfric, that way he could help out too. I'm not going to divide up two armies. If I had more, sure, I could fight on two fronts, but for now, I'm going to focus on one enemy no matter what. If Dark Elves would like to come to Norska, let them come visit for a period of time. They'll have a great time. Okay, I want my Marauders to get ready to go into combat. I'm going to let them die initially. That should be good, I think. Yeah, I'll let two of you charge in. Wolfric will join in later. I've been playing a lot of closer to tabletop, so I'll have to remember how to play Still Faith Overhaul. They're dynamically different modifications whenever someone inquires which one is better. I can't tell you that. That would be like me saying, hey, Dr. Pepper or Coke or whatever, man. Doesn't really matter, but you get my point. It's really up to what you want to play and what you want to do. It's all a different flavor. Okay, let's go straight into combat now. I'm gonna take that one wall. You can't stop me today. Now, Manticores, come right over here. You got it. You know where to go. Let them hit you a little bit. It'll be okay, I'm sure. I'll let you charge in as well. Wizard, come on in. Everyone is going in now. Take them all down. I've got a powerful army who's ready to go into combat and to destroy our enemies. And later on today, I've got a surprise for you. If you know what it is later on. <laughs> oh man, you're going to love it. It's a late night for me, but I thought to myself, hey, why not give them what they want? Norska. Bit of a change here. We've got to complete our campaign, so we will. I've learned how to finally back up my modifications. So I can finally, finally keep campaigns going no matter what. Provided, you know, no one takes off their modification from the Steam Workshop, then we're good to go. If they do that, then not so good to go. Okay. I'm so used to closer to the tabletop where the radius for a tower isn't really that wide. And here, it's very wide, evidently. Look a looking tower. All right, let's move over to one side briefly. Uh-oh, uh-oh. Come on down here. You got it, buddy. You're okay, buddy. Don't let the bad people hurt you. I'll take care of them. All oh, right, I've got magic, don't I? Yeah, I do. All right, leave him alone. Leave him alone. You're being a bully, okay? He's just being a bully. Manticore's move again. I get to use some magic, though. Don't mind me. But he's right over here, right in the middle of their formation. Enjoy! You're like, hey, I'm having a normal day in Kislev. Oh, by the way, Firestorm, Flamestorm. And that's how we drop many people. Oh, and I mean many people. Look at that. They are melting. Literally melting. Oh, come on. Head back into the formation. Ah, oh, darn it. 139 dead. That's a few dead, sure. Okay, Marauders, come on down here. Let's go kill more of them. Manticores will help out, sure. What about you? Oh, you can't climb into that? You can't get onto the wall? That's a shame. What a shame. Oh, you're really killing off that group. Get out of here, boys. Get out of here. They're beating the hell out of you. I'm going to move a few more of you up. Maybe one of you over here. That should do it. I lost too many to that freaking tower, but we're okay now. I'm not going to move anyone out yet until my manticores finish their job. Right now, they are doing their job. It's beautiful. Each one has like 42 kills right now. We're going to get another attack going later. I'm attacking a few to crossbow men. I guess I could bring in more men. Yeah. All right, fine. I'm not supposed to show. I didn't want them all down here already, but too late for that, huh? When I get another flamestorm in, you guys are going to be in trouble. Oh, do you want to fight him? Okay. Good luck, by the way. He's a pretty tough guy. Do some magic for him. We're gonna buff him up, give him more melee defense and armor piercing damage as well. 93 melee defense. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Okay, time for a flame storm right over here. Yeah, I should have put that a little bit further up. Marauders are fighting down here for now. I'm bringing in more soldiers to go fight. Good work, good work. All right, so you're moving up. Marauder champions, move over here. You'll be up in a little while. And look at that flame storm. Just obliterates so many of them. Again, it'll take me a minute to get used to my faction, but it's some great blood. Oh, you're in right into it. Bold move, Cotton. Bold move. Bold blood for you. 
looking at 314 dead now. Not a bad beginning. I've got my Marauders down here who are cutting everyone into little bitty pieces. Oh, beheaded. And he's out of here. These Marauders are no joke. Watch me stampede over everyone. Today's the day where I'm going to stampede on everyone. It's going to be a lot of fun. I think it will be. Come over here. Push in a little bit. Icehorn Marauders, come over here. Keep on fighting. Thank you so much right now. You've done a great job so far, my friends. Okay, come over here too. Manticores, you keep on going. Finish off every single crossbow unit. At least like right in the middle of it, but he's okay right now, I think. He's all right. 314, you've killed how many? 22, only 22. But you can see his animations. He's just flying right through them. He's got armor sundering. He's got a bunch of cool abilities where he's able to just obliterate the opposition. Yeah, look at that. Missile resistance, okay, from the mist, 22%. Not that bad, not that bad. Go kill those guys over there. You'll form up over here. The rest of you will push in. I want more of you to push in right now. It's very important that you push in and go fight more of these guys. All right, am I killing more of them? I could do it right there, I suppose. I can just buff up what I have nearby. Let's buff up everyone close by, I suppose. We might as well get that going. And then I'll buff up our leader. Let him go fight. Let's figure out. Okay, Marauders, you can keep on obliterating them. And if you look at it, these freaking Manticores are still attacking a few more crossbowmen. Let's keep on doing that. We've got a few more to go after. I've got more champions who can kill them. Go finish off more of their warriors right now. Oh, you moved in. Okay. I don't mind that too much. A little bit more magic for you to utilize over there. Enjoy, my friend. And then I'm going to buff you up right now. Now he's at even more kills. He won't move back into them. It might hit a few other crossbow men. Oh, great. 45 kills for our leader. I almost feel like I should fast forward a little bit just because we're not in a challenging battle. A battle that I'm really worried about. I've already broken a great deal of them. I wonder if they're all broken now. They're not all broken now. Okay, never mind. Push on in. Push on in. Don't let up. Oh, I know you'll beat some freaking swordsmen. Go do that then. Oh, hi there. Go kill those handguns. They've gotten 11 of you. You can charge in now. If they want to stop and shoot at you. Great. If they don't. I love that they got their in officer too. That's pretty cool. They're like, oh, never mind. My boys are like, yeah, let's get them. Oh, they're quick. Holy crap. They've got mixed weaponry and they're about to hack these guys into pieces. Got them. That's what I'm talking about. Okay. Now let's take it out. I don't think we largely got it. That's looking pretty good. Let's go finish it off real quick. Manticore is going to let you come on in too. It's time for you to obliterate another enemy. All right, all right. So we did our part. I've got my warriors in here. We're going to bring in more warriors now. Let's just get them down here real quick. Oh, hold on. We're still finding that group of swordsmen. Okay, never mind. I was only kidding. I killed 370 now. That's a great amount. Hey, come up here. Go fight them. I've already killed 80. You can kill a few more. I think it'll work out for you. I think you've got the merit, the power, all that good business over here. All right, let's go wellers. I know you guys are busy. I like to very much move in. Let's try to move in a little bit over here. Screw and move in. Okay, let's fast forward a little bit. I think we're good on where we're at. So I'd like to very much just get going. I normally wouldn't do this here, but they're just not enough of a threat to me. If they were a threat, then I'd say, all right, you know what? Let's, you know, tangle up a little bit. Let's fight. These guys are not a threat to me. It's just about letting my guys get to them. 75 kills for my leader so far. 77. We got some knights moving in. Oh, very scary. Very scary. I'm just trying to get my boys in. Pardon me? I told you to move over here. You can go take out those swordsmen. I told you to move up there. Good old pathfinding at times can always work out well. Oh, hi there. 
That's what I gave her fast forwarding, right? I don't have you. Okay, I guess it took back the freaking gate. Okay, that's why. I was wondering. I was like, oh, come on. All right, fine. Come over here then. Come over here then. I'll let you take that. I have to apologize to you. It's like almost five in the morning right now. But I've had a full day out. I'm not tired. I'm kidding. I'm exhausted. But I'm not that exhausted to where I can just go to bed. Not without conquering kids' love. I just can't do that. It wouldn't be right. <laughs> I'm just losing it right now. It's okay. Okay. Civilix. He's out there fighting. My Manticore is holding out, too. I'm going to let you come over here. Go fight some more knights. There's a lot of knights over here, so I'd like to very much get into the middle of it all. These Manticores have so many kills right now. We've killed so many of them. Let's go fight more of them. Come on. Did you beat him yet over here? 116. They've killed how many? Still only 11. They lost everything. All right, so now we've won. See? All the better for it. Let's end our battle. One decisive victory for the team. We did a great job. So that battle is now over. We're looking at 239 loss. We're looking at 1,000, or not 1,100, but 1,477 lost from Vadim Kislevin. That's how you know he's extra Kislevite like. Kislevin. One hundred one killed by my leader. Three eighty by some magic. Magic boys are powerful. Again, that background art is fantastic. I enjoy stuff like that. I enjoy good, unique art style. We're just doing our stuff right now. So now we're getting back to the campaign map where we can go handle some more affairs again. It should be quite a bit of fun to see it all play out, I think. An ambush battle is fun when one army surprises another one. Oh, really? I didn't know. I wasn't aware of that. That changes up my day. The knowledge I now have will allow me to conquer the world, I'm sure. Anyway. So now we've beaten them all. We can sack it. Then we can come back. I could use some money. We're going to sack it. Now we get to warm up for a minute to chill out. Get level two. I can't really get any of these guys, right? No, I cannot. I try to block them. You got the money. You did it. Now you're level three. You're growing in power, my friend. Searing Doom. Take that. That's for architecture. It's a little bit more income. Plus 15% would not be so bad. Plague of Rust. And over here, Glittering Robe. You've got more magic. Okay. What about you, Knut? Nothing for you. Come over here and try it out. Critical failure. Okay, he's wounded. He's out. Hold off the weird. You fell too, but you're level 11 now. Cool. I'm going to give you a war horse. Actually, I'm kidding. Not yet. So much money. I'm going to give you still technology and spread corruption. There you go. You're waiting now. You're getting ready to attack. I've got 9k for income, and I'm making a lot more money at that. Okay, what do I want now? Let's go look around. I strike forward. Troll country isn't that happy. What a shocker. I'll take that building. Alright, start our own camit. What do you need, buddy? I think you have it under control. We're still making a lot of money right now. Upkeep goes down. Right? What else do we have over here? Nothing too fantastic. All right. The Conclave is over here. Hillspire Mountains. They're over here too. Let's go find out what's on the border where we might need to really defend. Like over here. 1700 again. Serpent Jetties over here. Another wall. That's how we're going to defend. Holy crap. We've got a big army on the way. I'll have to build another defense nearby by the time they get here. Four turns to build up, but look at the defenses I have. I have one leader. I think we'll manage somehow. Somehow we'll manage. All right, so you've got a huge war camp. Very good. Start our own camp in. You don't have anything yet. I don't want anything yet here, I guess. I'll have to wait. Well, hold on, hold on. Let's go look over here. Growth would go down, but it's income. I'll get a feral mammoth. It's a chaos totem. I'd like to make some money. Sure. You convinced me. Done. Okay, more Chaos Corruption. I'll take that. I want people happier. There goes a lot of my money. Now I get to end my turn. 
right now. I might do a close battle pretty soon. We yeah, have we've got a war in two fronts. I didn't want to fight over here, but I kind of had to. I wanted to go straight to the friggin' Dark Elves, but now I've got other enemies to bother. It looks like the Orcs have lost already. They didn't take long to lose. They were completely brutalized already, too. We're not even that far into the game. I'm not going to fight the Ever Chosen, though. At the very least, I can just begin to level up, become more powerful until the Ever Chosen is here. Then I can let him go into the Empire and beat them while I'm going to go fight the freaking Dark Elves or whoever else I want around the world. I've already beaten Archeon many, many times now. He's not some inhuman challenge for me anymore. He's not an obstacle where I'm that worried about everything. So let's go ahead and do that real quick. I'm going to take all that money. Largely because, again, it's a little town battle. If it wasn't a town battle, then I would change my mind. But it is a town battle, so I would rather push on and focus on my leadership. And I like to do that quest battle too, as I did mention before. That's really the big goal. Okay, so now let's have a look. I'll let you move in a minute. Yeah, I can't believe we were able to beat you two. We didn't kill your leadership off, but that was a great amount of money. Thank you for donating to my cause. I don't know what you're going to land on. You're not going to do that well over here, buddy. Okay, income from raiding, from raising. Yeah, not right now, buddy. Not right now. But you can give me some magic. Great job. You're about to be at a new level. You're not there yet. Let's go back in and bother them once more. That many, really. I didn't lose anything, thankfully. Okay. Now I get to burn it down. For the hell. Alright, very good. Alright, level 11. What do I want to give you? I have the gods. I don't believe I want to give you that. Spawn of Chaos would be pretty cool. That would be a lot of experience per turn, so we could do that. Sure. I'm going to give you nation. Oh, rank 20. Okay, I understand now. I'll give you Woundmaker and Woundmaker again. So now you're really tough. You can do a lot of damage. You're just a monstrosity of war. Very good. Hey, little buddy. Let's get rid of you real quick. You're going to let me have a lot more money if I get rid of you. Cool. All right, so we know that we need to build things up a little bit more, don't we? Tier 5 over here. We'll take that. Might as well get my walls going over there. Now I have beefed up locations. Let's go into battle. He's level 17. Let's go fight another fight. Ooh, a tough guy, huh? Let's go take out one of our major hunts again. It's very exciting to bring back a series that I know that many people have been wanting. I've been hearing about it a lot. Oh, hey, can we see Norska again? I've been like, ah, I don't know about that. Largely because, to tell you the truth, my series are very long now. Each video is like one hour long, and I don't want to commentate if I'm bored sounding or if I'm tired. If I'm going, hey, guys, welcome. No, that isn't good. I've got to make sure that I'm enjoying myself each and every time. So if I feel like if I try to do too much that I won't be enjoying myself, I'm not going to try to do it. It wouldn't be fair to you. It wouldn't be fair to me. But I'm enjoying myself. I'm having fun, and I like it. And I'm all about that right now. And so that is what we're doing right now. Monster hunt time. Brinigus Trex is here for the taking, my lord. The weather is fierce in these climes and is worsened further. You must break. I got you. Okay, here I have to use a minute of slow motion, potentially. I don't know yet. I haven't really decided, but let's move back a little bit. So first off, we know that it's going to be a tough battle, right? Spears will be in the middle. That's fair. Great Axe Infantry will be over here. Berserkers are going to be on the left and right flank. Dense Formations again. Javelins, you're going to be back here killing. Trolls, I want you to mix it up with my infantry. Mammoth, you'll be back here. Harry Cousins, you'll be back here. Man, that mammoth really changed up my game just by being alive. Freaking fantastic. All right, so we got everyone together. Let's begin the battle now. A sudden chill overwhelms me. We can barely feel our extremities. We're talking about my penis. Anyway, let's get ready now. Ooh, we got some nasty trolls. I feel like, if I remember right, they bring in some friends too. Will it be nasty? I'm pretty, like, close together. So this is going to be... Kind of rough for me, I think, but... Hey, yeah, you know what? Let's wait here. It's really all about my bear hunters. Now they're doing a different type of hunting. 
Okay, so he is here. How tough is he? Welcome to the salty platoon. I was trying to think of a funny pun, but I couldn't think of one right now. <laughs> I'm just going to tell you the truth. <laughs> Alright, I still got one of the flying boys. Just nearby. Why not? Are you coming after my hunters? Is that what you're doing? We've already almost killed one. Well, that didn't take long. Go after them, boys. Alright, go after the big boy over here. We'll go attack over here. You'll go attack over here. We got some boys coming to fight me. That's okay. I'm going to go block them off real quick. And over here too. All right. Hair Cousins come over here too. Mammoth, you too. I'm getting all the nasty ones to go after him. There we go. Oh, I know all about it. I'm just waiting for my boys to get away. All right, Bear Hunters. Go get them. All right, Manticores will come after this one over here then. If that guy wants to leave for a minute, let him leave. Come on, try to chase him down, try to chase him down. Get him, get him. Keep him pinned down. I'm about to take out the big one. It didn't take that long. I've got way too many javelins. We're gonna have some friendly fire and I understand that, but these things happen, okay? Oh yeah, I've got more in the way. They're not gonna leave it. They're not gonna leave it alone, not right now. Go take out the trolls, come on. Go kill the trolls. What a glorious offering. If only that was it, right? Enemy Lord is now dead. Good more on the way. Let's go take him out. Freaking fantastic. Go take out these guys. You come over here. Manticores, you're going to go after this one model. There we go. You'll come over here. Great Warriors will come over here. Hunters, I want you to just hunt after that flying creature coming at me. Well, Frick has killed no one so far. Oh, they got a breath attack. Okay. Very shiny. Very shiny. Here comes another one again. I've taken out a lot of flying creatures, haven't I? That's a pretty good hunt, man. That's a pretty good hunt. I've got to tell you. Okay, bear hunters, let's go. Yeah, hit a quick troll or two. You got it. It's already broken. Go after the flying creature. That's the one that needs to go away. Move over here real quick. You can come back. I want all of you to come back. If you don't want to come back, I'll just go fight them over there. That's fine, too. Let's come over here. Manticores, you'll go attack. You'll come over here and go through some trolls. Mammoth, you can do your job real quick. Let's go right now. Is there a flying creature gone? Let's go after this one over here. Again, there's probably like a number of fire that's going on, but it just doesn't matter. We're winning the big fight. It's all that Wolfric will want right now. We're doing the big hunt. I remember playing this in the past. Oh my god, the first time I played it, it was so difficult. Now, I know the challenge. I know what's presented before me. There are only trolls, and I'm playing still face, so I know where I'm at. Yeah. We're already done strong, so we're done over here now. We've won the battle. The battle is now over. The day is better. Alright, so the battle's over. I took him out, beat the friends. We can leave. 169 lost. And you can see that, well... We lost everything. The brood of that dragon has now been put into the ground. Pretty darn good. So, we've got one more quest out to complete it. I can't wait to be able to recruit new creatures. It's going to be a lot of fun for that. All right. After that, I can begin to move on to Kislev a little bit more. If I destroy Kislev, I can briefly go after Nordland. If any other Imperial foe would like to come after me. Okay, hopefully Arkham will be here by then. But if they come after me, I'll beat them down too. And then we can move on over to the Dark Elves, as I've been wanting to do for quite some time. The really big limitation for this faction is just really the financial part of it. If you didn't have to worry about that, you would easily steamroll. That's just a fact of life. And I'm always going to take some extra money from that. Thank you. One hunt completed. And now I'll get some rare equipment. A monstrous offering. Well, you know who I'm going to give that to. To which god? The Hound. I don't like getting anything for the Hound, but... I wonder if it's bugged out or something. Maybe so. 
Might be bugged out. Well, that really blows. If so, eh. All right. War Mammoth for our good buddy. Okay, so he's better off. I'm now going to give him Fanatical Savages. Stronger than ever. Where's my next Feels good. Okay. To the four I should be able to like, kill up in your lands, but it's not really letting me do that. No, you'll cost me too much money. I have to go to Hell Pit anyway. Just go kill them. You can't move yet, so you're done. Alright, I'm going to try to get you to block their army. You failed again, but you're level 4 now. Very good. Use your stuff over here. Get your things going on. Set them an upgrade. I strike forward. I can do that. I've got so much money now. I've made a lot of money. So I can upgrade every single building that I have at this very moment. Now we can end our turn again. I've got all this extra gold. Reichland's looking powerful. Yeah, I could like steamroll through them. It's just a matter of these little armies getting together. The big wall won't be really reinforced by that scenario at all. I don't believe so. I highly doubt that as much as... That would be positive and good for everyone involved. They're just not going to be able to pull that off right now. There's Nagarond again. Harganeth. And everything else that's going around. Himri. All right. Yeah, Nordland's looking pretty rough now. After losing two armies, they're looking really, really rough. Hopefully one day we'll get like a fantastic mod manager. That would be fantastic. A trade agreement dissolved. World Walker and various links. Military axe is broken. Ooh, they're not doing so well, are they? No, they're not. I'm guessing they're done for. That's what I'm assuming anyway. Right of the Wanderer. Okay, buddy. I'm gonna have you patch up for a little bit. Oh, you're gonna have to help it. Okay. Oh, hi, Oslin. You came all the way up here to settle. Holy crap. Oh my god, they're settling everywhere up here. You animals. All right, let's move you back down over here real quick. Yeah, again, they're not making my life easy, are they? Glad I've got all this extra money. All right, let's go see if these guys have landed. They have. Oh, hi. All right, well, if you're going to bother me, I'm going to bring up Throg. Throg is very good at what Throg does. It's just Throg smash. That's what Throg do. Give you, like, three extra guys over there for fun. Just a throw into the fight. You got a Thor Ingerson. I'm going to give you Wound Maker. Natural Thirst. Got Olaf the Weird. He's still alive. Hey, Olaf. How's it going, man? Well, I'm going to give you some Spread Corruption. What am going to do for you, pal? 1%. You did it. He's wounded. That's a good start. I know you can't get him. You can try anyway for fun. Ah. That would have been nice. Okay, so we've got a few more units to go after. I've got to get you to kind of rest up a little bit. Actually, let's come over here real quick. There you go. You'll heal up a little bit faster. We'll go after like Zavostra and Kislev. We'll kind of move down here together. And then go forever too. Afterwards. Yeah, these two are still pretty much done for. They're trying to raid over here and cause issues, but they're not able to hold up, are they? Not really. It's not a lot of you who would like to trade. Good thing is not that hateful of me, but... Those who no, you don't want a peace treaty. Marganath, do you want a peace treaty? Can. After I beat their tails, maybe they don't want one. Yes. Deliver your missive and then oh, you don't want a peace treaty either? Really? I'm trying to lower things down a little bit with their saying no. Alright, so I'm not fighting them yet. I could like finish that now, but I guess I'm going to fight some of the Empire. I mean, I guess my Marauders would be cheaper. 10% cheaper, so that'll be nice to have. Got a lot of technology. I gotta get more later, but that's gonna lower my income. Oop, no, don't, don't want to destroy that. Oh, crap. Watch out. Get him away. Okay, so we gotta end our turn again. I don't have a choice but to end my turn right now. Got two armies right by each other. Kislev has lost their western portions. Nordland is looking rather weak. I don't know when they'll be able to get a new army together. They got their two leaders kind of stranded up north, and they're unable to really get back home for whatever reason. Or they're trying to go back home to Van Heimling's own a little portion of Norska, but that's okay. I would rather them own that so that Bretonia's not able to come at me directly and so easily. Because well, you know they would like to. So I'm going to go after Kislev. Like the actual city of Kislev. And make a lot of money from that. You know I'm going to make a lot of money from that. So after that, I can go after what's left of them. If more of the Empire would like to fight me, they can do that. I'll probably still leave one army over here. Maybe. But we're just going to keep on moving on to the Dark Elves. I'll probably 
Actually, I might just go over to the northern lands over here and take out Ostlin and Nordlin, then move over to the Dark Elves. I'll make money on the way. That's like really the big goal is to train up and make money on the way. Oh, they got Torvald. How dare you? You have harmed Torvald. He is a great warrior. Is it some money? It's a shame. Let's come over here real quick to Prague. Oh crap, didn't mean to do that. Ah, my bad, buddy. That's okay, though. Oh, Felman, hey. Felman. It's like a Dinkelberg scenario. All right, let's come over here. I can let you get this guy over here. I feel like he would be a huge change for you. I'm just saying, man. Three turns to wait, though. Someone's gonna need him. I might get like an extra army to come out. I could do that later. We'll have you come over here. Got your own wizard, buddy. Oop, my bad. Take that, take that. Okay, what else do I want then? Enemy leadership goes down. Ah, I'll probably grab the rights of Shornal whenever we go after the big foe of mine. Okay, let's go ahead and upgrade things real quick. I think we largely got it. I think we got like most of it. Out of Anaheim Mountains, I forgot. Am I taxing? I'm not taxing. There we go. I'm making a lot of money from that, but I'll I'll take it. I'll take it. Hello, I hope you're fighting them. Yeah, I'll probably get this new Hunters. I might get like one extra army to go kind of chill out for that, but I'm gonna let Wolfric go out. I'm so glad we have those two together, or this would have been so much more annoying than it had to be. It just, I mean, could you imagine that? Have my armies divided? Oh, crap. I mean, fortunately, this looks like Sylvania's still alive. If I could help them out, let them take over whatever they want. I don't really care. I'm just doing my own tough guy thing. Hey, that's a lewd pose for that banner. Pretty cool looking banner, though. Like, you yeah, you know how we feel about naked ladies. Put on our damn banner. I'll take that one to fight you. Land Pestilence, you're over in Lustre. You should be over in Lustre. I don't know where you're at now. The chieftains want pity. All right, so we're fighting Oslin as well. Never mind, we'll be over here fighting. I've got to try to get a new army over in the west now. That's unfortunate. I didn't want to do that, but now I kind of have to. I'll just supply them with a lot of money now. Glad they came over here. I just gotta beat them. Beat them away. That's all I gotta do, really. Hold the location, beat them away. I don't know where they're going. Oh, crap. Maybe after a different location. Ah. What? Wait, did I get the frog? Or did I get someone else in? I guess I got someone else in. My bad. My bad. So moving over here. That's the Bjornlings gathering. It's, um. Not a great. Force, admittedly. Where's my next Not my best location, admittedly. Alright, so we got a pretty big force over here. Oh, well, you're freaking Wolfric. What do you care? <laughs> He's like, yeah, you got a good point. Didn't think about it like that. Didn't think about it like that. I'll spend two turns doing that. Just going after Zavashra and Boris Tolov. I'm gonna have you come over here now and go after Castle von Rocken. All right, so we got another. It's crazy though. They don't let me up, man. They just don't let me up. They're just fighting so much. Okay, Olaf, come over here. It's gonna be a really tough campaign, I think. They're just not letting up. They're gonna hit me everywhere. So we'll see how it all plays out. Out of the mist. We'll take that. I've been waiting that for a while. Okay. Mind of the swamp. There's like other things I could take too to kind of help him out. More arm. I mean, 10 more armor, whatever. Okay, so I'm going to grab this over here. Get more leadership. I'm going to buff up my boys, I think. Okay, income from raising. That's for quite a few turns. We'll take that. And it's going to be a short episode for today. I did have like a very major event for a cool surprise that's coming up. So I can't have a long part for today, but I just wanted to kind of get you some content so that you could see that we're back. We're back, baby. So go ahead and leave a like down below if you would like to see more. Thank you for watching and just look forward to more content later. And as always, until then.